Oh man, it's been a long time, guys. How are we doing? We're back. Explain myself. You said you what is going on guys welcome back to another video my name is Ari and in this one we're back to the valley guys we're back from Miami back at the crib grinding already I've been coaching call after coaching call today it's been crazy been putting in a lot of work but honestly I'm so happy to be back Miami was great honestly I fell in love with the city it was just perfect everything was absolutely beautiful but you know obviously I wasn't as productive as I am here because there's so many distractions so many cool things to see so many things to do and all those things so obviously I'm happy to be back and I'm happy I can provide some awesome content for you guys and I do have some awesome content today. So a lot of you guys have been making ad sets. The way that I show I make my ad sets and that's totally awesome because it works for me. But today I want to show you kind of another way of targeting too that maybe you haven't thought about and you know I, I am testing this. I don't test it too much but I do want to show you because obviously some of you are like oh well you know this method isn't working for me. This method isn't working for me. So I kind of want to show you just like a little other alternative something else else that you could test and I have tested this method method before and it does work obviously you know you, you you know I'll show you a few different variations that you can use so that you can see results on your own but anyways guys we're back to the full daily content grind no half-assed content we're going all the way here and you guys already know honestly I missed the I missed my house I miss you guys and even though I did post daily content it didn't feel like it was the most valuable content and you guys already know we provide the best valuable content on YouTube so uh, I'm gonna stop talking and I'm gonna actually get to my computer let's go all right guys we're in the computer now and yes I am starting a new campaign for this specific ad set uh, just because I don't know I at Gabriel's event he did stress a lot of the fact that he actually duplicates ad sets into new campaigns so that's something I've been testing a little bit but now I'm actually gonna test you know this campaign is going to be specifically for very different ad sets you know just things that are kind of really weird out of the ordinary just testing new different things so that's what this campaign is going to be for and i want to show you you know the in the the targeting that i was thinking about that uh, i have tested before and it does work but i haven't tested it on trend cove yet so i'm going to show you exactly pretty much how i do this maybe if this would load so we click conversions okay perfect so <clears throat> it's going to be a conversions campaign still I pretty much always do conversions, let's be honest here. But anyway, so I'll, I'll type the name of the campaign. It's going to be WC, website conversion, uh, fishing rod. And then we'll, we'll do, you know, the BEP, uh, you know, $13 BEP, weird ad sets. That's what we'll, t well, that's what I'm going to title it. All right. Uh, just so you kind of get the, the idea here. But here's the thing. So I'm still going to target worldwide, still going to target worldwide. But I'm still going to optimize for purchases. Everything's going to be the same except for the detailed targeting. So that's where we're going to make it a little different. So what we're going to do here is obviously worldwide. Worldwide. And then we're going to, as always, exclude our these countries. Not for any... The only reason why is because of their culture, guys. Like, they're not as impulsive as people in, the, you know, some other developed countries. So we're just going to do that and exclude that um, and then we'll also exclude China and boom that's perfect 1.6 billion people pretty insane and then we'll do English all because we want to show it to people that speak English now why is this showing me less than a thousand people uh, I don't know maybe Facebook is being a little weird whatever it doesn't matter we'll just keep going with it and then right here we're gonna click not expand interest we don't want to expand the interest and oh look it it's already predetermined uh we're gonna run it on facebook feeds and instagram feeds oh look it and now that that fixed that that's that's kind of strange so eight six hundred and eighty million people but obviously we're not done here guys we're gonna add a few more things here so this is pretty much what the video is about so usually you know my way of doing things is i pick one interest and narrow it down by engaged shoppers but this time okay this time what I'm going to do is look for really, really passionate interests, really small interests. And I'm going to stack them into one big audience full of little passionate interests. And I've talked about this before in the past, but I've never actually shown it in a video. So I thought, you know what, let me just make a video about it so you guys can kind of see what I'm talking about. So, so let's see, let's just type in fishing. Let's see what we can find for smaller interests. So typically I like to use big, like big interests uh, and, you know, kind of 
go pretty wide with my or pretty broad with my targeting but like I said for this one we're gonna go small interest uh, but passionate interest so we'll actually t go on Google here so we'll actually go on Google here and we'll target uh, we'll look for fishing brands uh, Sims fishing hat so hatch uh, I mean, I, I don't fish. I've always wanted to go fishing, but I've never gone fishing. So, you know, if any of you guys, you know, want to take me out fishing, I'd, I'd take it. So let's see, Sims, Sims fishing products, perfect. Two hundred and nineteen thousand people. So that's tiny. I don't know why it still shows like eighteen hundred people. Um, so let me just pull this up on Audience Insights quick, just to see kind of what we're working here with. SMM. Oh wait, well, no, it was Sim. Sim. Oh, Sims. Sims fishing products. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see the location. See what countries really like this interest. Cause, yeah. See, that's what I figured. It's actually. Oh well, that's there's actually a lot of countries. So we're, you know, um, we'd go anything above 150 percent. So we'll probably just do all of these. Um. So we'll target. You know what? We're just going to leave it worldwide because there's going to be so many other countries too. So this is going to work fine for now. We want to start it out broad, like I said, but we're doing small, passionate interest. So let's just see the suggestions. What do we see here? Uh, fishing, Trout Unlimited. Oh, I like that. So well, let's do Trout Unlimited. That one sounds pretty passionate. Now let's see. Sage Fly Fishing. Oh, Sage Fly Fishing. Um, nope, too big. So usually I would go with these big audiences, but like I said, this method is, you know, targeting small ones to make up a, a, a big one. Okay, so these are still pretty big, so we're, we're gonna just do the suggestions tab like we did before and find some really small ones here. The Orvis Company, what is that? Let's see, the Orvis Company. Or is a family-owned retail and mail order business specialized in high-end fly fishing. Perfect. So we're gonna go with that one. It's pretty small. Um, fly tying. Fly fishing tackle. Let's do that. Hard fly fishing. That's pretty small and passionate. So that's what we're looking for here, guys. A small, passionate interest. Because uh, obviously smaller interests tend to be more passionate about you know certain products. So perfect. Okay, so that's probably good enough. You know we got one, two, three, four, five stacked interests. This should be good enough. But you know obviously you could do however many you want. This is just I I kind of like to stick with five to seven with this specific strategy. Uh, and that's it, guys. This is all we're gonna target for this interest. It's just a bunch of passionate interests targeted worldwide. Um, and yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. So what we're going to do here then is pick our placement. Like I said, we're going to do Facebook feeds and Instagram feeds. And then um, we're going to leave this at five bucks a day. No problem. And perfect. So we'll be good with that. 70 click or one day view. We're just going to leave it like this. We're going to let Facebook choose at first. And then if this turns out to be a winning ad set, what we'll do is duplicate it and split test all these different variables. So don't worry about it at first. This is something you worry about later. Okay. So we're going to do here is we're going to name it. It's going to be um, worldwide. We're going to do uh, 18 plus and I'm just going to name it passion net interest. Or actually, let's 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 name it fishing stacks or stacks fishing stacks. Boom, boom. That you know, I I know what that means, so that's why I name it that. But if you want to name yours whatever you want, but make sure you know what it means, okay? And then we're also gonna do um, uh, the audience size, which is 2.1 million. And then we're just gonna do the budget, five bucks a day, simple and easy. And then what we're gonna do is click continue. And obviously here we're gonna pick our ad and that is the easiest part but here's a little trick okay I don't know why this isn't loading okay perfect so a lot of you guys are wondering I always use the same post for every single video or I mean for every ad set unless I'm doing some retargeting then I might test different ads but uh, you know I do always start with uh, uh, my the same post so what I'm gonna do is go find that post so that we can build up a ton of engagement on that certain post and the post already has so much engagement on it that uh, I, I think this interest is going to work just fine. 
and let's just let it load here it's taking forever as always okay cool so we're here and let's just go find the specific so this is the 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 only post that I run ads to so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna we're gonna copy that post ID we're gonna get rid of that and then we're gonna copy this post ID and then we're gonna go here on the ad we're gonna say use existing post and this is what you want to do this because when you click here you know it doesn't show you any the, the post that we want right so how you get around that though is you click enter post ID and boom paste post ID click submit and um, just like that we got the post and guys let me be honest here uh, I've seen this video being used so much by so many different people now it's very annoying but obviously there's nothing I can do about it so it kind of sucks uh, it's kind of making the the sales it, I can definitely see it in the sales of Trend Cove but at the same time I don't see it that much I mean look at the, this is a little update I guess today almost six hundred dollars so far today it's only eight o'clock we'll definitely get to six hundred roughly two hundred and fifty ad spend so that's pretty good over you know almost two hundred dollars profit and as you can see we've surpassed eleven thousand in just over a month pretty amazing guys let's be honest here that's you know insane only one product uh, pretty crazy so whatever let's just continue here and yeah that's pretty much it guys then what you're gonna do is obviously confirm it and you're good you made this new awesome ad set so definitely try this out guys let me know how it works for you I'm very interested not interested to know you guys already know if you're not taking action after this video I'm gonna be like so disappointed in you uh, I'm kidding it, it, it's fine but definitely make sure that after this if you do Facebook ads go to your Facebook ads manager make the same freaking ad set and run it okay don't watch another YouTube video just run this ad set trust me uh, and if it doesn't work out oh well you lost maybe 15 bucks you know yeah that's how much you spend on a meal so you'll be fine man you'll be fine so trust me now if you haven't subscribed you already know what to do hit the subscribe button make sure you turn on the notifications you don't want to miss these videos guys or the live streams I do live streams all the time and those are super valuable I love interacting with you guys and then the last thing is gonna be make sure you look at the Facebook group link in the description guys people are just killing it in the Facebook group they're just so helpful I'm in there sometimes I mean I'm not in there all the time because uh, you know I, I've been very busy lately I'm looking for an apartment I'm looking for a car I'm just doing so many different things guys it's crazy uh, so please bear with me I'll try to be as active as possible but uh, you know I'm trying to keep up with the videos here trying to show you some valuable content so like I said guys you know make sure you subscribe make sure you do all of those things and that's pretty much all I got for you today but the daily content grind doesn't stop so you guys already know you'll see me in tomorrow's video so peace out